Oh, okay, Morpheus, you me. evil son of a bitch. Okay, I'm going to play Echo the no, Dolphin, I'm going to have... Game. Good God, that game yeah, no, if minute. I play Echo the Dolphin, the next minute I'm going to be in the fucking anger management class. Okay, so I found a quote that is much less about get this game and is more about when Golden was doing those trivia sections in... No, honey, because this is Africa. In Mario is Missing, you said? <laughs> Daughter. Trivia thing that kept annoying. Oh, was that different? Uh, game? No, that was a different game. Oh, okay. Well, whatever that game was, I feel like this one's that the best. Fucking to live. Mm. It, uh, to live okay, is to suffer. It? To survive is to find some meaning in the suffering. Frederick Nie. I'm not pronouncing that last one. All I can say for sure is that it might be. Really? Maybe. Thank you. Oh, <laughs> yeah, she's sitting missed... on my shoulder. Let's see if I can get it in one rock. Thinking she's a Pokemon now. <laughs> okay, so unfortunately I'm out. Come on. Quote. So okay. if we run into any more problems, I have no more quotes to help us on this journey. <laughs> All right, All right then. Nicole the Pikachu, take it easy, will ya? All right. <laughs> when did you became such a big? No. Guy? I have a All right. <laughs> Ooh, extra no life. Pikachus. I yes, don't care thank you. Jaleesh, <laughs> so she's admitting that she's in the chatterbox. Yeah. That's the funny thing. She'll admit of certain things, and she does not realize how hilarious and that is. Back up. How about instead of being a Pikachu, honey? How about you like Ow, to be more? Shit. <laughs> Ow, hell. Is that a Pokemon, honey? <sighs> hey, don't tap my head. That's... Don't tap my head. That's... Be good at cool. <laughs> Wow. Because they just think it fits you. Now it <laughs> No. The reason right. why they're calling you a Pika Nicole oh, this is as cute and adorable as a Pikachu. That is very much Pikachu. <laughs> would, that be a, would that be a Nikachu or a Pikachu? No. Oh. Nikachu? No. Get, get over Pikachu. there. Get over there. Don't. But why? That was a good burp, Belly. That wasn't me. That was me. Oh. Sorry, G. <laughs> I thought you were- I thought that was Ellie, sorry! I guess that says something about me, doesn't it? Okay, take it easy. You're gonna fall- you're gonna end up falling if you keep doing that. Cause I just don't think of it that way and you'll be fine. If I'm being quite honest, everybody sounds the same when they do it. <laughs> Oh my god, there's another hyena. Really? Another hyena! Run away! Not now, honey. That uh, moment on the screen was right. That hyena killed you by latching on from behind and tearing off your lion ball. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, well, what? Yeah, um, we're taking, <laughs> you know yeah, what? We're taking the 108. We're, we're, so much, we're take the so much. degree no pad of that. So much for uh, Simba not making Kiara. She, can't, Nicole can't hear me. No, she can't hear us. She can't hear you guys. Don't worry. 
She's and I also turned. I also muted the uh, Twitch so she can't hear you. Good call. I yeah. can't be in a call while listening to Twitch anyway. It's super disorienting for me. Yeah, same. Yeah, it makes it very hard to hear you guys while the while the stream's going. Cause it's like, uh, uh, I'm, I'm confused of what to listen to. My brain's not trying to process right. <laughs> so yeah. Fucking one oh, day when the, like one day when they're able to completely eliminate latency on the stream, then. I think they do that on purpose because there's some people who do multiplayer gameplays and they do that to prevent anybody from Look using otherwise, it. yeah. Yeah. I hate to... Doing your little fun of playing Pokemon. You're Fuck. starting to hurt my sh Thank you. <laughs> Morpheus called it so much for Bree. Yeah. <laughs> See, Morpheus knows what I was talking about. Because, like I said, so much for making Kiara. We're not even playing anything related to Pokemon. <sighs> oh, my Yeah, I was God. about to say, doesn't Kiara and, to a lesser extent, Kion have to be a thing Who? at some point? <laughs> oh, that Kion, you said? Pride. Yeah. Oh, that's that's from the sequel. Yes, that's that's literally what I was referring to. Yeah. Oh no. Can really? We, can we just all agree also. that Lion Guard sucks? I didn't like the pilot. The pilot's okay, but the rest of the series is just, it just contradicts uh, the entire the entire no, timeline. No, it's but, already but contradicted it to begin with. Like they fucking butchered Kiara so bad because in the movie she didn't want to be queen. But in the uh, Lion Guard pilot, she embraces wanting to be queen, listening to Simba. I'm just like, what the fuck is all this? Like, they basically retconned the second movie, and now I'm just like, wait, does that mean Kobu has been Thanos out of the block? Yeah, that's that's a tough thing. So Kobu's been erased. Kiara's had a lobotomy. Here. And... I'll let you go. So you can go play with those. <laughs> oh, wait, did you say Kiara got the bottom line? Yeah. Yeah, huh? Oh, yes. oh my god. It, this sums it up really well. Wait, where'd it go? Oh. Do you have to kill the hyenas before going in a cave? Or... Yeah, you actually have to do all that before entering the next um, the next part of the cave. Yeah. Apparently. Um, um, apparently it's been said that Kobu nice. appears like... in, like, Season 2 or some shit like that. Yeah. Um, and there was also well, Zira and a lot of the other do. Lion King 2 cast. Yeah, he's right. He's... Yeah, no, I remember there was that song. Oh. No, okay, like I said, okay. when it came to the pilot, I hated it. I saw the first, like, two episodes, and it was like a dramatic improvement. Uh, CC Misawa about uh, Kion putting aside his biases. Uh. It was a little ham-fisted, yeah. I'll give you that. But it was aimed for toddlers. And that's my biggest gripe. Um... The, the pilot talked down to the uh, the audience so much, and that's because they put it on Disney Junior. I'm like, why would you do that? The Lion King has been known for a generally wide audience, and you're just going to make it specifically for toddlers? You literally turn the Lion King into Teletubbies, and it was such a cringy, idiotic move. Without the smiley sun, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah, and don't boss, get me started on the, Bunga. Oh, Bunga. <laughs> oh my god. Bunga Good was obnoxious. God. Say it, Logic! Oh yeah, fucking... Sukuzama. I, I also want... Like, oh yeah, no, Sukuzama was an insult. Cause the way the song starts... Fucking... Bunga goes shitting on Akuna Matata, which, while it's my least favorite track in the movie... It, it's so iconic, and it was there for a reason. It was to cheer up the audience. And he's like, Cool, oh, Akuna Matata? Nah, it's all about Tsukazama. Fuck you, you little shit. Respect the historical value behind it, man. The thing Respect the classics. Is that they gave a bunch of random animals inexplicable and seemingly random superpower. And it tries so hard to be MLP. Also, something I'm definitely never gonna be too quick to accept is that Kion and gave him the unrelenting force shout and thought I wouldn't fuck 
<laughs> it also doesn't help that when it comes to the lore behind Scar once having the um, having the roar, it just makes me wonder, like, Never okay, so roar. he tried to overtake the throne by taking care of Mufasa. Why did Mufasa let Scar be kept the whole time? Why didn't he just exile him then? Because that just makes Mufasa look like an idiot. That makes Mufasa look bad. Yeah. This is what happens when you add a lore in Lion King. If you're gonna Retcon create some lore, at what? least, like, at least create a good narration that, like, connects well. Because it doesn't connect well. Also, Make sure it sticks, people! Doesn't that imply that Scar was at one point strong enough to be chosen for that power? Because I thought the whole thing about Scar was that he was weak, but really fucking Fuck! And that's what kind of had him looked down upon by the others and why he was pretty much an afterthought in the runnings for King. I don't know. I don't know how anything works. Let's try leaving it at that. We, we don't want any brains getting hurt while we're our ah, fuck. if i ever do get around Let's to continuing more with the lion king marathon yeah i'm gonna tear the return of the roar a new one. Oh boy yeah no because oh my god that i hate the pilot it was one of the most embarrassing pilots i've ever watched like people have issues with the my little pony pilot the episode that okay. one, at least it had a they sense of adventure and had something worth watching. Line Guard, I didn't want to watch the okay, series after that. Okay, doesn't he resurrect Scar? Technically, no. He doesn't come back to life. He just goes in a similar position as freaking Mufasa. But what, like, from what I recall, Hyena kind of raised his soul in a volcano. I was like, okay, first of all... What? Why would... Wait, 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 hold on. Yeah. Scar is Mufasa's brother. I don't get the connection here. That's ba they basically just pulled a similar trend with Okay, Mufasa so you know how Mufasa is, is basically the sun baby face thing, right? That was a joke from Teletubbies. No, Mufasa is looking down from the heavens upon everything. That's where he is. What the fuck? Well, at some point in the Lion God, there's a similar thing that I remember where Scar's head appears in a volcano somewhere. Because Fuck. he's looking up from hell. Hell no, but... fire! <laughs> the fire! The of thing course. that confuses me is that why would Scar ever be interested in doing anything, let alone helping the hyenas that literally... Because he knows that they are desperate, and he can still easily manipulate. They ate. <laughs> These hyenas did, because they obviously don't remember. The whole fucking herd ate. They probably used his bones as toys for their children. Ugh. God damn it, morbid. You know I'm right. Yeah, probably. Hyenas have all the ethics and morals of, well. Actual hyenas, or just yeah. actual animals in general. Sometimes, okay. Thing is, it's I've learned to never question or an idea behind this. I think they were just trying to get an excuse to bring Scar back into the. I feel, yeah, like huh? it would make, I feel like it would make sense if, like, they summon him from hell only for him to just like uh, torch them. What? Which obviously 